let's begin decorating. So I have all of my bottles. I grabbed my pink bottle. I wrapped some ribbon around it. And then I just took some hydrangeas from Dollar Tree. Using my glue gun, I placed them on top of the ribbon. And then I used the same ribbon at the top of the bottle at the opening. And I just placed it around there. And that was it for this bottle. For the second bottle, um, I took my green pastel bottle and using uh, the gold leaves from one of my previous tutorials, I glued it onto the front of the bottle like so and that was about it. I mean, super easy. In one of my previous tutorials, I had mentioned a pink bottle which I had decorated and I had wanted to show to you but I didn't have it because um, I couldn't find it. My sister-in-law won it in our raffle for Easter Sunday. So I actually found it. So moving right along. Uh, now I have my green pastel bottle. I grabbed my burlap from dollar1.com, wrapped it around, grabbed green glittery leaves from Michael's, glued it on top. Then I put some yellow gems on it and then some green matte gems around the border. And that's it. And this bottle is done. Then I took my blue pastel bottle, grabbed some gray and some steel gray, regular silver, meshy silver, flowers from Michaels glued it on top, put some silvery gems on top, and then I grabbed those steel gray flowers and placed them at the opening of the bottle. And then this bottle is done. Then I grabbed my other blue pastel bottle, grabbed some glittery blue flowers from Michaels, some dark blue flowers, um, I placed it at the front of the bottle, and then I also glued it at the opening of the bottle. Then I grabbed some tiny gems and placed it in the center using my stiletto. Because these gems are so tiny, you really just can't do it with your nails, so I just grabbed my stiletto, my X-Acto knife, and placed it in the center. And these are self-adhesive, so I didn't need any glue. And that's my third bottle. So, then we have my yellow pastel bottle. And what I did was I grabbed my green lace, and I wrapped it around. This lace is from Ecuador when I was there. I visited a craft store, a ribbon store, and I just fell in love with this lace. And it's really cheap over there. I think it was about 20 cents a yard or something. I wrapped two rows of this lace around my bottle. Then I grabbed these yellow shimmery flowers. Um, I don't know where they're from. They're actually from my mom's stash from years ago. I grabbed it because I thought that it went well with this lace. So I just grabbed a bunch of it, cut it with my shears, and I placed it on the front. Now my last yellow bottle. These green stems are part of my stash. Um, I actually I think I talked about this once where I was at my dad's shop and I went shopping, quote unquote shopping, at his shop. Um, he's a mechanic. In his office, there were flowers all over, artificial flowers all over. There was beads. There were planter gems, garden stones. So I went, quote unquote, shopping. And so these stems with the butterflies, I found those there. So I thought for the yellow bottle... I would just glue them on there, which is what I did. And then I put the butterflies on top as well. And I thought that it came out really nice, very simple, but I think it looks really nice. So here's each one by one. Here's the pink one, the green pastel, the second green pastel, the blue pastel, the second blue pastel, the yellow pastel, and then the second yellow pastel. And here are all of the bottles, and I have the first pink pastel bottle on there as well, <laughs> the one for Easter. After you paint these bottles, ideas just come to you based on the base of the color that you paint them. Ideas just come to you. Just look at what you have and go crazy. You know, most of these decorations were just on the fly. I'm like, okay, what do I have and what goes well with this? So that's basically the best advice that I can give to you. 
So I hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you liked what you saw, please comment, like, and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, please hit the bell to be notified of new videos. Have a great day, everybody. I appreciate you watching my videos. Thanks so much. Bye, guys.